8. Christina Hendricks Christina Hendricks has been an actress for quite some time now, but she really didn't come into widespread fame until her tenure on Mad Men. Chances are, you've seen her before though, especially if you're a fan of Firefly. She's another actress who isn't quite plus size, but she made this list for a few reasons, most notably her influence on how Hollywood sees beauty nowadays. She was named both the sexiest woman in the world and the most attractive by Esquire, and it's been said that she has the ideal figure for a woman and that she's the embodiment of beauty. She's been considered a role model for a lot of women, to the point that some people have cited her as an influence to their own breast augmentations. On the flip side, that's not necessarily the best thing. Hendricks has said the hyper focus on her looks has made it so people don't necessarily see her work. I was working my butt off on the show Mad Men and then all anyone was talking about was my body. It's a lesson to us all. Just because a person is one of the hottest women in the world doesn't mean that that is all that they are. 9. Mindy Kaling Vera Mindy Chokling from aka Mindy Kaling is the star of the Mindy Project and was one of the stars of The Office. In many ways, she's a pioneer since there aren't a ton of Indian-American TV stars out there. She's not on this list because she's over a size 16, because she isn't. She's on this list because she's a major icon for a more body-positive Hollywood. Unlike some other stars out there who spend a ton of time on their personal appearance, Mindy Kaden doesn't make that the driving force of her life. Instead, she puts her time into spearheading her own show and making it one of the best things about Hulu's current original lineup. Even her character doesn't make dieting a big deal. It's a part of her life, sure, but it's not the only focus, and that's so important for people to see. That's what makes her a body positivity icon, and what earned her a spot on this list. 10. Jill Scott Jill Scott is an incredible singer who's released five albums since the start of her career. She's also an actress that's had a lot of different roles over the years. She's been in Tyler Perry movies, and she's also been a superhero. More importantly, she's taken part in a lot of charity work, including starting her own organization, the Blues Babe Foundation, which works to get minority students into college and help them pay for it. She's also going to be the principal of the Duke Ellington School of the Arts for the 2016 school year. Now that's pretty incredible. 11. Tess Holliday Ryan Mijent Hovind aka Tess Holliday isn't just one of the most famous plus-size models out there. She's the first size 22 model to be signed to a major agency. Not only is she gorgeous, She's quick-witted and has no problem jumping into the fray when it comes to issues facing plus-size women. She spearheaded the number sign FI or Beauty Standards movement on Instagram, and once demanded the boycott of social media accounts that made her and other plus-size celebrities thinner without their permission. She's pregnant now, and has been talking about the struggles that come with being plus-sized and pregnant. Not only is she proud of being a plus-sized model, she embraces the term wholeheartedly, and she believes that you can love your body at any size. As we know, one of the hottest qualities a person can have is self-confidence, and Tess Holliday has that in spades. 12. Monique Monique real name Monique Angela Hicks is a comedian and actress that's been around for a really long time. Chances are you remember her from the sitcom The Parkers, and if you don't, you might remember her from her talk show, for that time she hosted the reunion for Love and Hip Hop. If that doesn't jog your memory, you'd probably remember her from her incredible portrayal of Mary Lee Johnston and Precious. She won an Oscar for that role as well, along with practically every other award that she qualified for in 2009. That becomes even more impressive when you find out that she didn't campaign for her Oscar like most actors do. The power of her performance was enough to win everything. She's also an author and a radio host. Monique, aside from having a very varied and storied career, has a really interesting personal life, too. 
She owns the right to the story of Abby McDaniel and has a real connection with her, and she's in an open marriage. Also, if you don't remember her doing anything else after winning all of those awards for Precious, it's because she didn't. She was blackballed from major roles for a while. Colin, I got a phone call from Lee Daniels maybe six or seven months ago. And he said to me, Monite, you've been blackballed. And I said, I've been blackballed. Why have I been blackballed? And he said, because you didn't play the game. And I said, well, what game is that? And he gave me no response. The next thing he said to me was, your husband is out bidding you? But he never asked me what salary we were asking for. You know, my husband actor and producer Sidney Hicks and I had to change things so we wouldn't have to depend on others. So we do it independently. She's clearly a force to be reckoned with. 13. Rebel Wilson Rebel Wilson is an absolute treasure. Not only is she a talented singer and actress, She's absolutely hilarious. She's one of the few actresses that I can remember that was told not to lose anyway for a role, like she was with Fat Amy in Pitch Perfect, which is a gem of a movie if there ever was one. She's also the only actress that I can't think of that started her acting career based on a malaria-induced hallucination. That claim was put under a good deal of scrutiny thanks to a reveal about her real age but it's still a good story nevertheless. She's currently in the process of a major diet, so she might not qualify for this particular list in time, but no matter how much weight she loses, she'll still be funny, and she'll still be beautiful. 14. Amber Riley You probably know Amber Riley from her legendary run on Glee. Sure, Glee might not have been your cup of tea, but you'd have to concede that Amber Riley was among the very best things about the show. She was also the good witch in the lit performance of The Wiz, and it was announced recently that she going to be Epi White in the West End run of Dream Girls. Not only is she an incredible singer, she's an incredible dancer too. She's the first African American woman to win Dancing with the Stars. Amber Riley isn't just the singer though. She owns a plus-sized fashion line called Riley Land Fashions, and she models the clothes herself. She also has no problem at all with schooling anybody that's rude to her about her weight. 15. Queen Latifah Queen Latifah has had a long and storied career, both as a singer and a rapper, and as a whole lot of other things. She has a ton of albums out and is considered one of hip-hop's feminist pioneers. She's an Oscar nominee and a Grammy and Emmy winner, not to mention a ton of other awards and nominations, and is generally an outstanding person. She's also a major influence on the R&B, soul, and hip-hop genres, and major artists in those genres owe a lot to her work. On top of that, she completely bucks the false stereotype that plus-size women don't exercise. Since she's also a kickboxer, 